The Wild Shore by Kim Stanley Robinson is a post-apocalyptic novel set in California, 150 years after a nuclear war has devastated the world. The story follows a young man named Tom, who lives in a small coastal community called San Onofre. Tom is fascinated by the world that existed before the war, and dreams of one day exploring the ruins of Los Angeles, which he believes to be a magical place. The Wild Shore is a coming-of-age story that explores themes of nostalgia, hope, and the power of storytelling. Robinson uses vivid imagery to create a rich and detailed world, painting a picture of a California that has been reclaimed by nature, with tall grasses and wildflowers growing where highways once stood. The novel is also deeply rooted in Californian history and culture, with references to the missions, the gold rush, and the beach culture that is so integral to the state's identity. One of the key themes of The Wild Shore is the power of storytelling. Tom and his friends spend much of their time listening to the stories of the older members of their community, who recount tales of the world before the war. These stories are a source of comfort and hope for the young people, who long for a world that they have never known. Tom is particularly drawn to the stories of Los Angeles, which he sees as a symbol of everything that was lost in the war. In his mind, Los Angeles represents a world of endless possibility, where anything is possible. However, as Tom grows older, he begins to realize that the stories he has been told may not be entirely true. He learns that the world before the war was not perfect, and that many people suffered even before the bombs fell. This realization is a turning point for Tom, as he begins to understand that the past is not necessarily a paradise to be reclaimed, but rather a source of lessons to be learned. Another important theme of the novel is the tension between tradition and progress. The community of San Onofre is deeply traditional, with a strong attachment to the customs and beliefs of the past. This is particularly evident in the character of Ish, the community leader, who is suspicious of anything that threatens the established way of life. However, Tom and his friends are more open to change, and are eager to explore the world beyond their small community. This tension is brought to a head when a group of outsiders arrive in San Onofre, bringing with them new ideas and technologies that threaten the established order. Throughout the novel, Robinson explores the idea of nostalgia, and the way in which it can both inspire and constrain. The characters of San Onofre are deeply nostalgic for the world that existed before the war, and this nostalgia drives much of their behavior. However, this nostalgia can also be a source of blindness, preventing them from seeing the world as it is now. As Tom learns more about the world beyond San Onofre, he begins to see the limitations of nostalgia, and the importance of living in the present. In conclusion, the Wild Shore is a thought-provoking and beautifully written novel that explores a number of important themes. Robinson's use of imagery and language creates a vivid and immersive world, while his exploration of nostalgia, tradition, and storytelling provides a powerful commentary on the human condition. The novel is a coming-of-age story that will resonate with anyone who has ever struggled to reconcile the past with the present, and is a testament to the power of hope and imagination in the face of adversity.